And Valley News Live 10 at 10 continues with No Wait Weather. A very pleasant midweek day as we take a look in with our Valley Sky Cam on the runway lights out at Hector International. Just a gorgeous night, another beautiful sunset, and the cumulus clouds we had dancing across the skies giving way to a few cirrus, and that's about it. 70 degrees on the thermometer. We have a 62 degree dew point, not as muggy, but still a little humidity in the air out there. A light north northwest wind at this hour. Take a look at our uh, time lapse tonight with the setting sun, and there's those cirrus clouds and a few planes coming in at approach at Hector showing up on the time lapse tonight. A beautiful evening out there. Here's a look at your hometown temperature, 70, uh, 69 rather, in Devil's Lake, 64 in Langdon, and 66 out in Gwinter. A lot of 70 degree readings from Breckenridge all the way out towards Fergus Falls, and 64 this hour as well in Bedette. Here's a look at the radar, and right now we have absolutely nothing going on in our neck of the woods. We do see some storms exiting our region toward the windy city of Chicago, and some showers and thunderstorms that developed over the Rocky Mountains, sliding over the high plains of Wyoming, and that's about it in the region. So, uh, for now, very quiet. Now, the colors that you see on this map indicate the temperature at one degree intervals here, and 70s are more orange, and the 60s are more yellow. As we go through the evening hours, we'll see more 60s out there, even a few upper 50s. Now, there'll be some pesky clouds out in the central Dakotas, and look at our day tomorrow. We start out with temperatures near 60 across the board. Light wind from the west-northwest. And I want you to focus on northern Minnesota. Going through the early part of the day, a lot of sunshine across the Red River Valley and the eastern third of North Dakota, while we'll see a few clouds beginning to form in northeastern portions of Minnesota. That's going to limit some temperatures there. Now, as we go through the afternoon, the heat will be most likely from the Red River Valley up and down it and all the way out to the west into North Dakota. While here in Minnesota, we'll see scattered showers and clouds. Notice the cool pool and temperatures here. A lot of 70s there will be limited. You're limiting your temperatures as we go through the afternoon, and that means you'll cool off quite quickly in the evening. So spotty showers, a possibility across our easternmost counties in northern and central Minnesota. And it looks like a few clouds in the far west. The rest of us will enjoy another summer-like day across the valley. Light north winds throughout the day in Fargo. We start out very close to 60. Temperatures ramp all the way up into the mid-80s for your afternoon. Your hometown looks like 81 degrees in Langdon and a Devil's Lake reading of 81 as well, 85 in Oaks. Lakes country, a lot of upper 70s to near 80 south. We're talking Ottertail County and Becker County. You get north of there in Clearwater County and much of the uh, Bemidji area, we'll see a better chance at 70s for the afternoon. Hey, the bees are busy out there, and, well, there are some sunflowers starting to really uh, bloom out there. Thanks for sending in the photo, Donna. Here's a look at your planning forecast, and it looks very dry for the majority of the region to close out the work week, and I think hot, thanks to the dry weather we've had in Fargo, will be close to 90 on Friday and again on Saturday. Saturday will have scattered shower and thunderstorm chances in the afternoon, and it still looks very warm across the region for Sunday. A chance of some showers mainly in the morning hours there. Now, as we head into next week, it still looks very warm and summer-like, and we do have chances of storms on Tuesday and Wednesday, but I will caution you, those are pretty low chances, hit and miss showers at best. So uh, you can guess keep on the sprinkler mode at home to okay. give the grass just a little drink of water and to keep the toes cool, of course. It's dry out there. It is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you.